Scorpio. Welcome to your bonus. And cards are already flipping around. You have the Ace of Ace of Swords and the Nine of Cups, Scorpio. So you're going to get clarity on someone who is interested in you in a good way. Um, there is someone that's coming in. It could have Scorpio, um, Cancer, Pisces energy, but I also could have Gemini, Aquarius, or Libra energy that want you to know how they feel about you. And I feel like this person could be a new person. So let's see. Let's see. All right. So what's going on for Scorpio bonus? Angels. Scorpio bonus. Ooh, wow. Okay. We got some cards here. We got some cards. This person has issues. All right. So I'm seeing like, and you know, Scorpio, I feel like we talked about this in your main spurt today, um, where I saw an energy that there wasn't a decision that was made. I don't know if it was you or Gemini, but I know I seen like this and this form of reading before, okay, where there's a conversation or a situation that haven't been confirmed yet or a decision, okay? Um, and it's about this proceeding into this relationship and trying to make things work because there is a lot of ties here. So you could have a family with this person, business with this person, money tied up with this person. I feel like it's money with this nine of, um, pentacles here, you know, financial freedom, you know, happiness, you know, the 10 of cups also follows, um, you want this 10 of cups. You want to see you guys make it in the future. There's just too many things tied up here. Again, children, children is also in the, the ace of pentacles, abundance, your legacy, you know? And so I feel like this is for someone who has children with this person. All right. Or some kind of home or some kind of things that you were building into going to that, going to that, um, situation. All right. There is an Aries, Leo or Sag energy here. Capricorn in reverse as well. Very stubborn energy, passionate energy to themselves energy. Um, you know, this is a person where they have a lot of things, a lot of demons that they need to heal from that they haven't. So you could be dealing with this person with um, that's going through like um, a di an addiction, which is drugs, drinking, sexual addiction, also a toxic environment. Okay. And this is a, something that they're used to. Um, it's causing a lot of conflict within you. Um, but I'm also seeing um, disappointment here in this read. A lot of loss here in the Three of Pentacles. Um, like you lost all kind of whatever you learned from each other. You just don't appreciate it anymore. Like, <laughs> A lack of appreciation here. Okay. Oh, third. Three threes. I hate to use threes, y'all. Okay. I feel like you're waiting for this person to come to you to try to, you know, assure you that this is what they want. And this is why you haven't made any kind of moves towards anything as yet. But what's important to you is your family, okay? And is your reputation, is is your home, what's important to you are these things, you know? And you want to keep them together here. And I'm feeling like there's this setback. Like, you know, of course, there's this mistake that, you know, happened in this relationship, but there's also an emotional setback. Like someone is just like really just covering all form of emotions when it comes to this relationship because 
there could be other people that want to see you fail, you know, your friends, your family, um, and you're trying to keep this to yourself in the moon. You're trying to keep secrets, okay? I feel like everything is going to come up to the surface right about now also um, because, you know, of course, they're saying this mistake have happened here and this person has just watched me you know, moved on with my life. It wasn't there for me. It wasn't there to console me. It wasn't there to assure me. It's like they just watched you just moved on with your life here because we have the three of pentacles. I mean, not the pentacles, the three of wands and then the three of wands also here in reverse. So it's like they're saying like, you know, it happened, you know, it's over. You, it's, there's no chance, you know, there's just no chance that you might just take up this relationship, which have a lot of baggage, okay? The devil is also here with this 10 of wands. There is way too much baggage here and is a lot to invest in, you know, but I'm also getting that you don't have no problem investing in this, even though for some of you, you already know this is a sexual addiction, you guys, confirmation, sexual addiction, seven of cups right behind it under the devil. Oof, my goodness. I should have knew when I, I remember I was telling you like, oh, I'm getting a lot of threes, you guys. Three, three, three. I hate seeing third, three, 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 which is new love coming into your life, which I did express that from the beginning of the reading. But I also feel like, you know, that is also telling me about, you know, another person, you know, but this relationship here, we got the nine of the nine of um, cups here. Wow. But the way this ended, it was incomplete. Like, it's just, it's going to come back around, you guys, even though you feel like this person is over and done with. It is not over and done with. You have too much love for this person. This person still have too much love for you. This is coming off as some kind of, you know, beautiful, um, childish, um, you know, butterflies in your heart, romantic relationship here um, that you guys are still waiting for each other. It's just that one is, it's like both of you are waiting for each other to make a move here. This could be a long distance thing. Um, one person might have moved out of state here. That's what I'm also seeing, but, and no one is making the move. Like everybody's just watching this linger or fall apart or somebody could just be moving like watching somebody like leave you know but this is happening incomplete there is more to the story there's more for you guys to learn from each other here i'm seeing like you're you really thought that you know this person was going to give you some cups that meant something and you're still holding on to this because you're really like bottle about this in the high priestess being right next to the nine of cups like you're like your emotions are all over the place you don't know what to trust like you want to trust in this nine of cups but your intuition is like telling you something else like something is off here and for some of you you're just leaving and ending this because guess what we have the seven of cups again. Seven of seven is all about the seven of cups. You know, this person being unfaithful to you. The seven of cups is what causes tower. Do you see it? I'm sorry, you guys. Let me just put this here. Do you see the seven of cups in this tower? Right here. This is what caused this relationship to end. All right but you're going to get this huge offer, all right? Now, is it enough for you? I don't know. It's up to you, but I feel like the way you guys are looking right here is definitely someone that wants to be with each other through all of this, through all of this. What's on the back here? Oof. The back, what you don't see coming in the Six of Swords, moving forward to what? The cycle. <laughs> uh, moving forward to the cycle. You're not done with this person. This person is not done with you. You feel pulled to this person. You feel like you can achieve a lot of things. You feel like, you know, a lot of um, great things are about to happen to you with this wheel of fortune here. You feel like this person and you could, you know, build a legacy. And that's not, that's not you know, false because I do see the legacy here. The Ace of Pentacles, you know, um, this is this is what you're building a unit with. But there are so many things that you guys have to go through. Then this person is a little slower than you, 
okay? Because, and there's always that case where you are ready there and this person is coming off as pages and knights, all right? Where this person is still learning from you, all right? So this is what I see. This is what you need to look out for, Scorpio. I hope it resonates. I hope this helps. If it does, you know what to do. Like this um, video, give this video a big thumbs up here on my channel. If it doesn't resonate, I will have your playlist linked below as always. And again, Scorpio, you can go over to the Instagram and support your girl and click the link below. As soon as we reach the 5K followers on Instagram, I'm definitely starting those free personal readings over there. And also, guys, be very, very careful not to type anything in. Just click the link and be careful of, you know, it, you know, interacting with anybody on Instagram that's trying to be me. I never interact on Instagram unless you guys send me a message about a personal reading. I will convert you back to my Gmail account and be careful with that as well. Make sure to double check everything before sending me any kind of payment and make sure to correspond with me before sending any payments. Okay. Through my, I, my Instagram account, which not my Instagram, my IG, IG. Oh, God, I've been repeating myself all day and now I'm messing up. My Gmail account, you know, it's in the below section of this video, all of my videos. So please just um, follow these steps and, you know, you won't get scammed. All right. So love you guys. And I'll see you guys in your next one. Bye, guys.